World Series trivia time, Tony. Oh, boy. Are you let's ready this. for this? I'm, no, I'm not ready. I'm never ready, but let's go. Let's go. So this is about World Series specifically when the Diamondbacks or the Rangers were in it. I'm going to set my oh. timer here. Ooh, okay. Are you okay. ready? Oh, uh, nope, but let's go. <laughs> the clock begins now. What year did the Diamondbacks win their only World Series? Uh, early 2000s, 2001? Yep. Correct. The D-backs beat the Yankees in seven games. Who were the two starting pitchers in game seven? Oh, gosh. Schilling, I believe, for Arizona. And oh, who would have been starting for the Yankees back then? They've had so many good teams, it's all a blur. Um, El Duque? Fernandez? Not a bad guess. It was Roger Clemens. It was Kurt Schilling, so you get a half point for Kurt Schilling. Okay. Um, this set the record, the Diamondbacks World Series win, set the record for the earliest a Major League Baseball franchise had won a World Series into its existence. How many years did the Diamondbacks exist? Oh, man. I could be way off on this. Like six? You're close. It's four years. Oh, okay. Okay. Who got the World Series clinching, game-winning, bases-loaded hit for the D-backs in Game 7? Oh, my goodness gracious. Um, oh, man. I got no idea. Luis Gonzalez. Oh. That, that RBI single was the second World Series to end on an RBI single in a five-year span. The other was 1997 Florida Marlins. Which player was on the bases for both of those walk-offs? Ooh, Marlins and Diamondbacks? Oh, my gosh. It's going to be a hitter on the Marlins and Diamondbacks. I, I got to pass. I have no idea. Craig Council. You got time for one more. What year did the Rangers play in their first World Series? Uh, Rangers in their first World Series. Um, wait, was it that recent one? Wait. Yeah, 2011? No? So close. 2010. Ah, oh, man. Off by very, you. very close. That's not, I mean... To be fair, that was very, very difficult. Uh, you got a point and a half. Uh, 